Hello, my friends, and welcome back to Surrounded. I had an unfortunate series of events. It's just about sundown. I've just had to respawn. I have no idea where I am because it's a random respawn. We have no marker on the map because we don't have a GPS. I'm going to go to first person view. I'm going to take my trusty rusty knife and my bandage. I ain't gonna move on. I have no clue. We're somewhere near the borders, I think. Okay, what do we got going on here now? Gas station. Question is, is it the same gas station? Oh, they're chasing that deer. Perfect opportunity for me to... Pass by without issue. Got a crawler. Okay, not sure what we have here. Hmm. Looks like a vehicle yard. Maybe. I wonder if I should risk it. Wow, it is getting dark, dark. And we have a multitude of them. Let's see if I can start kiting them. Hey, you. Hey, you. Hello, knife, please. I was too busy holding right mouse and stuff, and I couldn't activate my knife. Okay, we've got at least another one in there somewhere. Hey, you. Sharp blade book, don't care. All right, there you are. Hey, water, fresh water. Okay, there is trash bin. Okay, flashlight, we're gonna equip that. Okay, I need to find out how I rotate items. Let's go to settings, controls, melee, move forward, jump, roll, sprint, shoot, push, stomp, interact, V. Push, push or stomp, huh? Okay, that's good to know. Inventory, equip. Distract, hmm. Night vision binoculars. I'm not seeing it. I'm sure that it rotates. Guess not. I was so sure.
because that pick is very useful. Does 24 damage. I think what we're going to do is we're going to swap to the pick. Car battery. else out here able to be no okay a little bit of weight there at least all right so if I hold Z Z I can attempt to turn on the flashlight but I have no battery for the flashlight oh here's something I know it is pitch black Okay, these are hunting boots. We're going to get rid of our office shoes. Put on the hunting boots. Put on the hunter hat. And there's a battery. Question is, how do I put it in the flashlight? Inspect. Battery. crack -a boom Frying pan, cook and deflect bullets. <laughs> That's funny. That's a shame that uh, I'll take that rope. I don't know if it's useful or not, but um, okay. Zed. Uh, flashlight. It does not appear to be providing any light. Oh, there we go. It was in the on position, that's all. Okay, well. At least now we can see. Oh, backpack. Let's open it. Nothing in it. It is a two, four, six, seven by six. That's a big backpack. Equip that bad boy. Um, we're not going to equip that right off the bat. Grab the cloth. Concrete wall. 308 rounds. Okay, we'll take those. But that helps immensely. Bunch of batteries charging up items. Oh, here we got something. Got a dry bag, which is not as as, as big as the one that we're carrying. Um, small generator. I'll take it. I don't know that it's a good idea but here's an ammo container and that's one of the beautiful things about this is that an ammo container only takes up four slots in your backpack but it has a crap load of slots to store ammunition but it will store only ammunition so we'll put these 308 rounds in there and um see that's a four by five So, I think that's everything really to take from there. All right. Well, what I'm going to do is I'm going to settle down in this corner over here. I'm going to turn off my flashlight. And I'm going to hunker down for daylight. Because we're just passing midnight now, which is why it said Day Survive 2. And I will be back when morning comes, or all hell breaks loose. Hello, my friends. Welcome back to Night Past Uneventfully. Well, actually, there was event, one event, which is that screwing around, I discovered that if you wish to rotate something, use R, and it will rotate. So there you go. Um... 
And uh, while I was waiting for the night to pass, I also did a little bit of research, and it appears that when you die in-game, rather than your backpack falling on the ground and being there for a certain amount of time, your character turns into a zombie and wanders around basically forever. And if you can manage to get back to the spot where you died and kill that zombie, you can get your stuff back. It's raining out. It's raining out. I think we've gotten everything in this area. That generator is going to be useful eventually. We've got a filter mask, which, um, assuming it has good filters in it, let's inspect it. It has no filter. All right. So if we find filters, we can add them to the mask, and that will allow us to enter radiation zones. I'm... Going to head down, and we're going to make sure we didn't miss anything in the dark. And there were some items here. Trash bin. A bin to remove items you no longer want. These are things that we can sell. I'm going to grab the stone just because I'm going to drink this water. And that gives us the empty container. I don't want to tote around too much junk. I'm hoping that today we can find a working vehicle. And again, I have absolutely no clue where I am. So, finding my my previous zombie, God only knows. How to find some food. Alright, we've got a building coming up. It's a church. It's a church. Let's move to this side of the road and just... Wait, is that a bill? There's a... Okay, it looks like there's a house back here. Is that a barn, maybe? Yeah, I think that's a barn. Let's see how fast this thing swings. Okay, it's a little slow. Yeah, it's a big old barn. Tractor in there. Come on, you. Spot me. There we go. I've oh, got a crawler, got multiple crawlers coming. Had to crouch to take them out. Yes, I will happily take that. Remember, we use, I don't care about the book. We use the antiseptic to make bandages. Oh, there's a, another one that's 5x5, five five, so it's not as big as the one that we've got. How many did we get? Only one? Okay, we need two antiseptic to make bandages. Where are you? There you are. Oh, 
Oh, he's still alive? Okay. Alcohol. I don't know that it's necessary of, necessarily of any value to me at the moment, but we'll take it for the moment. Nothing on him. Looks like two more. I'm holding down right mouse and moving forward to see if I can manage to take him out. Because it only takes like two shots from behind. I think that was the last of them. There we go. That will allow us to make a bandage. Assuming I have enough rags. I only have one rag. Oh, that's too bad. Maybe we'll find a piece of clothing in here. There we go. Suitcase. This should have clothing. All right. Red shorts, tracksuit pants, orange puffy coat. Yeah, there's a Shema. We're going to equip that. Blue shirt. Let's rip these up. Oh, I, I've never found anything inside one of the bags, but I figure I always check. All right, so crafting, rags, bandages. There we go. One left over. Ah, it's junk. I mean, it's not junk because we can sell it if we so desire, but as far as I'm concerned right now, that's junk. Uh, I need I need bolt cutters. Well, there is a vehicle repair kit. That's important. Now if we find... A working vehicle, electrical wire, random junk. Okay, I didn't know if that was a tool we needed to use or not, so. And no upstairs here, no upstairs. All right, well, that turned out all right. Getting a vehicle repair kit. There's actually a road right here. Yeah. Let's follow this road. We know the church is right over there. Let's see if this leads up to a house or something or just goes out to the main road. I mean, it's a barn. You wouldn't think there'd be just like some random barn. There we go. It's a house. One, two, three. That's a bunker. That gray right there, that is a bunker. It's a house with a bunker. Probably need a code for the door. Let's see if we can pull this fool in. There he comes. I don't think these stack. Oh, they do. Okay, cool.
Yes, it is. It's a bunker. doesn't have any value to me personally. It has no door. It is... Wow. Check this out. I think we may have just found our base, people. Because remember how we found that metal door? Well, that's back down the... Wait, no. Now I gotta... It was that the police cars that we found that metal door. If we can pick up that metal door, we can bring it back, put it on here. And be like secure. Of course, I have no idea where we on the are on the map. We could be way away from anything, but hey, you, come here. There you go. Thought there was one more. Maybe not. Search vehicle. Like I said, it's rare that they're searchable. Ah, uh, yeah. All right. So, another vehicle repair kit. A baseball bat. A fireman's axe. Some firewood. Uh, I don't have any kind of storage. You go there. What is that? Two, four, five, two, four, five. The axe is the important one. Actually, I don't care about the knife. Well, we don't know if we're going to need that for crafting. Hard to rotate it. Grab that for the moment. Face mask. Police shirt, office shirt. Come on, food. There we go. We're just going to eat this tin of sardines. And we're going to drink this water. I suppose we can't stack those. Nope. All right. But we can put down this generator in theory, right? How do we do that? Must just be with drop. If we can put down the generator. That'll get us some room. And in theory, give us power in the bunker. Okay, we'll be back for these. Oh, I'm going to eat this. Because we are starvifying. And I'm going to drink the energy drink. And we'll come back for this water. Good deal. Good deal, good deal. Okay. Um, I'm going to leave those things. Got another Z out there. Um... That's our journal. We can also get to it with Jay. Go to the Valley Safe Zone is our quest. 
Okay, so survived two days, traveled 1.88 kilometers. Uh, it's 1244, killed 14 zombies. We've not yet leveled. Our, we're building our fitness, our strength, our toughness, our sneaking, etc. Um, by doing those things, this is where we invest in uh, various skill points. How do I place this common buildable? Small generator provides electricity. Okay, hold on. Try vicinity. No, can't place it in vicinity. Place. Okay, why did I not see that before? Um, middle mouse wheel will allow you, allow you to uh, rotate things. But there we go. And if we come down to here and hit F, show generator range. I mean, just turn around and crouch here. You can see as I'm touching the generator, it's showing a, a distinct distance that the generator has an influence, which I think should be down below. Let's pick it up and bring it down here, I guess. We want to make sure that it powers our space down here. Because I think I am going to use this at a, as a base at least for now. Yeah. It'll cover the whole spot. Excellent. All right. Um... That does 24 damage. That does 30 damage. I'm going to drop that. Equip that. That there. We really need a container of some sort. And we need a 308 to go with those rounds. We need a working vehicle. Given the fact that we've gotten, um, make sure we activate our axe. Uh, given the fact that we've got vehicle repair kits, it means if we find a vehicle, we can fix it. Hey, you. A shiv, it does a little more damage than a regular knife, but this should go out to the road. I'm excited. I cannot believe we found a, a bunker like that. If we can go back to the uh, police cars we found earlier, and we can get that door, we should be able to place it. Which will give us a nice, secure spot. We'll have to come up with some light. Hopefully we can find a lantern or something. And nice, our uh, little driveway here actually has a, a landmark. Which is a good thing. I think it's a goat. It's like, what the hell is that? Anything in here? No. All right, we do have some sort of big tower down the road. Just want to check this vehicle. I don't think it's drivable. <laughs> 